Hey guys, I want to give a shout out to my friends at Guitar Kit World. Believe it or not, but this guitar that I call Bob the Junk Pile Archtop two weeks ago was a kit guitar. The neck was off of it. It was just a body and a bag of parts and um, I did some really weird stuff to it to age it to make it look old and to give it uh, the sound it has now. But I will tell you what, when I bought uh, this kit, as always with Guitar Kit World, the stuff was all there. The tolerances were such that I didn't have to do a bunch of sanding and weird stuff. I just basically did some sanding uh, and fit everything together and use some basic hand tools that most of y'all have. So don't let building a guitar freak you out. The best thing about these kits is you can build a guitar that is uniquely your guitar that has your art on it. And that's what I like about these guitars. I used to pick up a ton of these. I'm leaning for some. Yeah, this is a nice guitar. It's a 40 silver tone. It's got some cracks in it. I'll do some stuff with it. But when I send a guitar like this out on the road with an artist that's going to do 200 days a year in all kinds of continents all over the world, it's going to travel and it's going to be in a boat and on a boat and being jumped on and, and God knows what this guy's going to put it through. This guitar will be solid and that's where the kit guitar started. It's a good solid product. All the parts you need will be there. Um, and so we'll keep an eye on Bob the Junk Pile Arts Top. Um, follow the hashtag. And hey, thanks Guitar Kit World. You gave me a good product. And check it out. If this isn't Coveter's Corner, I don't know what is. See you soon.